Charles Darwin, The Beagle Letters, edited by Frederick Burkett. This is a, a major, major book, and we are delighted to be able to discount this for the first time. It's the £32.99 book, which through bibliophilebooks.com is £10. The Round the World Voyage of the Beagle from the end of 1831 to October 1836 is one of the most famous and important ever taken. Yet its original purpose was relatively mundane, to survey and produce accurate sea charts and safe har harbours for the Admiralty. Charles Darwin, whose name will be ever forever linked with the voyage, was not even the ship's appointed naturalist. His accommodation was free, but all other costs were paid for by his father. Time was pretty much his own, so he could observe, collect, think and postulate theories, and write and receive letters, as we see here. And following an excellent introduction by a leading scholar, Jane Brown, in chronological order, the full text of every letter Jup Darwin is known to have written and received aboard the HMS Beagle provides a first-hand account of the voyage. We follow him as he alights on the first tropical island, watches an earthquake flatten a city, learns how to catch an ostrich from a running horse. He witnesses slavery, political revolution and epi epidemic disease. We can also share with him the otherworldly experiences of seeing for the first time the Galapagos Island, collecting specimens and the remote islands of the Pacific. His tales of adventure and excitement are beautifully counterpoised with those recording the comfortable world of money society from his letters from friends and family in England. With a selection of original watercolours and pencil sketches by the ship's artist Conrad Martins, depicting landscapes, plants, ships, towns and people, and includes a Darwin Wedgwood family tree and brief biographies of over 500 people mentioned in the letters. Four hundred and ninety five pages over fifty colour and black and white illustrations, published at thirty two pounds ninety nine by Cambridge University Press and through bibliophilebooks.com, discounted for the first time to just ten pounds. Charles Darwin, the Beagle Letters.